Okay, Wayne Inspector. Shall we do this? Hey, why do you... Why do you twitch your tail like that? Why? It's like a fake spray. Oh, you're turning it on for me? Thank you, sir. All right, back away. Back away from the scale, please. All right, guys. The number to beat is 166.7. Uh, I feel like I had a good day yesterday. And, uh, yeah, I was down yesterday. Let's see if I can get even further down today and, and hit my biggest record so far. I doubt it, but we'll see. Here we go. Mmm. Tied. Nice. Still down from yesterday. Um, tied my lowest so far. So, uh, we're on the right track after that cheat day a couple days ago. Things are going good. I'm going to have another great day today. Daily ritual, guys. I got the uh, lovely nerdette awoken today. Like the sleeping beauty she is. Uh, unfortunately, I have to get up early, so that means nerdette gets to get up early. Mm -hmm. Sorry about that. Don't worry about it. It's okay. Oh, all right. Thanks, babe. And uh, she's hooking us up with some bulletproof coffee. We're both really excited when it comes to uh, getting up for coffee. If it weren't for coffee, it, there's no incentive to even get up. It feels <laughs> like. I know, right? Like, what if you just get up with no coffee? I just can't even imagine it. That would be boring. It would be hella boring. What are we going to do? Get up and drink a glass of water? <laughs> no. Can't wait up to Not get up. <laughs> Guys, when you put butter in your coffee, Nerdette claims that having this little blender is the key to making it yummy. Mm -hmm. Is it the key? It is the key because you can put it up here and make foam. Mm. I love that. Mm, buttery, milky. Or buttery but, coffee but, foam. Yes. That is so good. Then I fill it up with more coffee and then the coffee creamer. It's so good. <laughs> well, speaking of keys, guess who's the key to my heart? Better be me. This one right here. <laughs> it is you. All right. But bulletproof coffee in the works. And then I'm going to physical therapy hey guys I am on my way to uh, physical therapy in the elevator there was a mirror and I just had to do it so I just got out of physical therapy guys and uh, I'm on my way to I'm on my way to the uh, store I'm gonna be getting some more uh, keto food today and uh, yeah, I'm I'm going to be aiming for a little bit cleaner keto. You know, me and me and Nerdette have been doing it a little bit dirty. Dirty birdies, you know us. Check this out, guys. It's only been a few days, but uh all of the snow has pretty much melted. The streets are and the sidewalks, especially downtown where the streets are warm, the snow is gone. But uh, yeah, this is uh, it's uh, it's it's starting to clear up. I hope it doesn't ever snow again. But the minute I say that, it starts snowing again. So whatever, guys. Anyways, on my way to get more food, clean ke cleaner keto, not perfect, but cleaner. Let's do this. I'm about to go in this store right here. It's called Coop Extra. Yeah, I've been to one of these before, and uh, oh my goodness, this says Vihar Varmat. That looks so good. Hey, some of it's keto. I mean, that that chicken's keto. Those those patties might be keto. Lasagna, oh, not keto. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna go in here just do a little shopping. 
and uh, wish me luck guys all right so here it is guys got some of these good old handy dandy bacon snacks 60% protein these you have no carbs can literally eat these all day long and it's quite satisfying um, got some fresh spinach we went we got some bacon we went ahead with uh, some spiced ham slices got some uh, natural chicken breast right there and we got some uh, we got some uh, ready to eat avocados hopefully they're ready to go ready to enjoy special selection see not everything is Norwegian in Norway um, got some of these nice tomatoes right here and uh, yeah definitely gonna this is gonna be new to me eating some spinach but uh, oh and some chorizo slices this is gonna be fantastic guys eating a little bit more clean keto today let's see how it goes yeah I just had to show off this amazing looking church in the middle of the city they just uh, redid this whole place and uh, sort of refurbished it and did the the front area they they made it real nice and uh, this is this is an awesome looking church would you just look at it you guys looking at it and say yeah look at that and then just look at it people still ride their bikes even when it's ice and snow and cold AF right cool church okay bro what's up huh all right um, I'm working on my uh, lunch as soon as my lunch is done I will hook you up all right okay can you wait because this guy his his dry food is is still full but there's there's no more sauce for him to lick out of the uh, of the of the wet food so uh, yeah this is this is a crisis on the border right here so uh, we'll fix that bro it's all good all right so I'm gonna make these little uh, I don't know ham and uh, cheese bacon cups I'm gonna take some of this stuff and put it up in these uh, up in here um, what we're gonna do is we're gonna first we're gonna take this right here this is some olive spray and I'm just going to uh, spray the cups down a little bit I'm gonna make two of these one for me one for nerdette I'm just gonna slap a piece of ham down in there like that this is something new for me so I don't know how this is gonna go but we'll see and then uh, the recipe says to take one basically 20 grams of bacon per cup I hate measuring stuff but I'm doing it this time so 20 grams was actually one piece of bacon so one piece of bacon per Man, that leaves all this leftover bacon right here. What what are we gonna do with that? I guess we're gonna just eat it. I don't know. But um, I'm gonna make sure this cup is nice. And then it's uh, one egg per cup and um, a half a teaspoon of uh, almond milk. So I've gotten that already with some spices. We got some. We got some ground pepper, we got some pink Himalayan salt, and we got a little bit of garlic powder. So I'm going to take that right here, and I'm just going to pour half into each one. Let's see how this goes. I don't know, man. Um... And then it's, it says about 10 grams of grated cheese. I couldn't find Swiss cheese, so we're just going to... I mean, I don't think it matters what cheese you use. So I'm going to throw some cheese on top. And, uh... Oh, really? Okay. It's hard for me to look through the camera and put stuff on stuff. Lol. Come on now, nerd. 
Yeah, and um, that's it. I'm going to pop these in the oven and uh, see how they turn out. Wish me luck. Alright guys, there is one ham and bacon and cheese cup. Two grams of carbs. About 200 and something calories. So that's kind of high on calories, but um, I really don't care about calories too much. Anyways, this looks bomb. What do you think? Maybe I should make a whole bunch of these and freeze them so they're ready to go? I don't know. Looks good though. Uh, guys, I forgot to say, cook those in the oven on 200 degrees Celsius and don't ask me Fahrenheit because I don't even know anymore. But uh, 200 Celsius for 20 minutes. And by the way, they were bomb. I could have eaten two or three of them, but we'll have to live with just one and see how see how it goes. Um, I'm I I actually purchased a keto plan, which I'm trying to get a little bit more cleaner keto um, dieting. So I'm testing it out today. This is the first thing that that cup was the first thing on the menu. Um, it says that uh, I can have this snack in a little bit of. Uh, Homemade yogurt with sour cream, cream, sweetener, and chopped up almonds. So, I'm, I'm almost ready for it right now, but I'm going to wait like an hour, and then I'm going to have that, because not too long after that, it's lunchtime. And it's already 1 o'clock, so, I don't know. I'm testing out this plan, see how it goes. We we, we were tied for the lowest weight today, and, or, we, who, who else? Me. I. We, yeah, okay, you, me, and the nerd fam, all of us. Huh? I was down. Oh, nerdette was down, she said, so we were down on weight today, so it's all good. But, uh, yeah, see you at the next one. All right, bro, do you like uh, keto cat food? Well, here you go. Slash. Look at that, bro. Would you just look at it? Oh, look at that satisfaction. He just licks the sauce. He just starts licking the sauce. Oh, he actually ate a chunk. You're so cool, bro. Cool, bro. Keto cat food, get it? What? What? You have an important message to tell everybody? Hmm? Oh, oh, that. All right. All right, well, we'll keep that in mind. What do you guys think Slash is trying to say? Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, I have a good idea, bro. But, all right, he's out. Ladies and gentlemen, Nerd Ed of the North just made no sugar, no carb peanut butter cookies. I am tripping balls right now. Uh... <sighs> I'm gonna have Look to cheat. Empty space right there. Oh. Nerd ate that ball. Okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I ate one of the the, the balls. I'm sorry, I ate balls, but uh, I'm gonna want one of these after they've been baked. And yeah, let's do this. All right, here it is, the snack that the keto plan suggested for me, that I take half a cup of sour cream. A teaspoon of sweetener, a teaspoon of cream, and a handful of almonds. Let's see how good this is, guys. I'm I'm a little bit skeptical, but whatever. O M G, guys. Let me tell you right now, this is actually completely bomb. This right here is actually totally surprisingly yummy. I never thought that this would be good, but I started eating this with almonds, and it's like I made my own yogurt, I guess. Um, is this homemade yogurt with almonds? Either way, surprisingly satisfying, so I'm going to eat this up. Slash. Don't mind me, bro. I'm just trying to stretch out on the couch. I mean, come on now. All right, guys, so here we go. This is going to be a California omelet. Um, I, this was one of the things on the keto plan, so, uh, I'm just gonna give it a go. We got two eggs, we got a, 
one cherry tomato, we've got two slices of of um, chicken breast slice. We got like a quarter of an avocado, two pieces of bacon, and I never heard of this, but it said to slap up in there some mayonnaise and mustard. No cheese. This is weird. So, about to do this. Let's see some nerd magic. And there you have it, guys. Nerd magic. Let's see what it looks like inside. This was an uh, interesting uh, omelet that, uh, you know, with no cheese, but uh, mustard and uh, mayonnaise inside. Bacon, ham, avocado, tomato. This is going to be the goods. Well, that's it. Another day of keto vlogs in the record books. Um, thank you guys for coming. Uh, this has been a super cool vlog. Um, yeah, it's the the keto the keto diet seems to be working. Um, I reached uh, tied for the lowest weight yet today. It's uh. Hoping that it's going to be just a little less so we could break a record tomorrow, but, well, I ate some of those cookies that Nerdette made. Uh, she made those wonderful peanut butter cookies, and I ate like four or maybe even five of those bad boys. So, uh, I have a feeling uh, I'm just going to gain weight tomorrow, but we'll check the way in tomorrow, see what's happening, and, uh... Still going forward with uh, the, the cleaner keto eating. So I hope that uh, hope that I just start to feel good and have more energy and yeah, just start feeling overall better. Um, you know, I do feel pretty good. I just, I want to feel amazing. So we'll see how this goes. Come back tomorrow. Uh, hit that bell so that you guys will get a notification next time I have a, a new upload. And with that said, guys, thank you guys for coming. See you tomorrow. Nerd of the North. Peace out.